Good afternoon people, it's a beautiful day here, Saturday, just uh, after midday or 12 o'clock, whichever part of the world you're from. Just gonna go for a little uh, walk, probably be uh, hopefully around eight minutes or so. Just here, um, I don't know all these streets name, but we'll just say a JL Street, but I just wanna show a couple of these markets here. Uh, very good prices in here. Now this, this market here goes through a side alley which uh, ends up down that side street there. So we'll just go for a little walk. Uh, there you go mate, all right? <laughs> yeah, but like uh, the Australians uh, are usually very friendly here. Um, yeah, uh, I did have a bit of an incident the other day actually, but that was quite an amusing. I'll talk about that some other day. But most people here are very friendly. As I said, it reminds me of the north of Thailand in Chiang Rai. But most of these clothes here are very reasonable in this market. Now, if you go through to the main street, like they are a bit, uh, like they, 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 hello, like they do put their prices up on the main street, but in this area, their prices are very reasonable. And they'll, um, you, like here, like they'll just say like a very reasonable price. And if, if you're not interested, just walk off. And as you walk off, they'll actually drop the price down a bit more. So that's a little tip. But um, there are shops that are a fixed price as well. Now, um, I only come over with two pairs of shorts and uh, two, two shirts uh, because I, I only had seven kilo weight through the carrier I went through. But on my next trip, I've got 30 kilos with that. So I'm not planning to buy 30 kilos worth of, of clothing, but um, I've, I've already picked up a couple of shirts and um, some shirts as well but um, yeah I won't be going as crazy as I did last time I was here I bought heaps of shoes but stuff like this ranges in price um, I bought one for like my wife last night actually um, and I'll get her another one but but they're very cheap prices in this market as I said but when you get to the main street they do hello how are you thank you very good thank you Yes, like they always say hello, hello when you have a camera hello, here. Yeah. Hello, <laughs> how are you? Yeah, I'll come back after with, with uh, the wife. Yeah, so like I did buy her one like this last time and I, and I bought her uh, a similar one last night. With, yeah, it was one like this and um, it was only $12.50 Australia. Uh, this one here, so very good. Um, yeah, so on this street here, they do bump up the price. So if you are uh, here for your first time, you, like most shops have the same, same stuff. So if you don't want to pay what they say, just walk off and I guarantee, as soon as you walk off, they uh, drop the price by 50,000. And um, here's another little uh, lane, lane, lane way as well. So we'll have a quick look in here, but, uh, try and be polite you know like you don't have to uh, buy anything um, it's, it's a good tip just to walk around and just engage in in the prices and just ask uh, how much you sell this for um, I, I usually say what's your best price now there is a pretty cool market in there as well but I want to keep this video short and just show you a few things around so we'll probably go for another three minutes or so but in here they do have a um, shrine which leads into another market as well but very very good shrines are ah, that way like the gentleman is pointing that way I think that was a gentleman or a lady I don't know uh, apologies there but as, as I said just walk around and engage in prices and then you can w uh, work out because you, you don't have to buy stuff straight away unless you're only here for say a short visit uh, like I was out here for two months last time. I'm only out here for a couple of weeks and then we're going to uh, three other countries. So, as I said, this, this street here, that they do bump the price up a bit. Uh, so just walk off. Uh, don't, don't abuse them or anything, just, just walk off and then they'll drop the price. Um, so it's up to you if you buy it on your first uh, visit or just go out for a walk. Um, in Kuta, some places do bump the price up. I did find in Ubud and Sanur, the prices were very, very cheap as well. So if, if um, we are in Legian now, and I do find the prices in Legian very reasonable. 
Now, I've come down this part because I had a nice meal when the wife was having a sleep. Um, and I come, come down here and ate on my lonesome. Um, nothing wrong with that. I think, yeah, it was like the local I went to. And I had a really good um, Thai green curry. And it was really good. It was breast chicken with some beans, but the actual sauce was so amazing. So um, I did do a short, which I'll probably release before this video. Like I've got uh, 30 videos plus that I pro probably won't release. I've got 20 or so that I might consider releasing. Um, Ju Judas, hello, how are you? Uh, yeah, so you'll get asked for massages down here. Um, I've been going to the Lucky 8 uh, spa for like massages and they're really, really good there. Um, I went and had my nails done yesterday, had a back massage and a foot massage and it was only uh, $21 Australian, so that's uh, 210,000 Indonesian rupees. So I had a meal here yesterday and I was really impressed with the food here and the service as well. Like. Oh, they've got two uh, parts here as well, so I think the smokers uh, can smoke in the front and I don't think there's any smoking at the back, but you can certainly come here. Really, really good food, like the local. Um, prices are okay. Um, still, still half the price of Australia. Um, if you're after cheap food, try and eat in the Warongs. Um, so what we'll do is we'll sneak down one, one of these alleys and then we'll wrap this film up. But I just wanted to give this uh, place a plug because I really enjoyed their food uh, yesterday. So, um, so like with these types of dresses, don't pay any more than $30. Like you can talk them down to say $15 Australian. I, I have got one for um, $10 Australian, which is 100,000. But um, that, like normal price is about $12.50 to $15. So try not to pay anything more than that. But um, if well, I, I, they do have a great selection of kids' clothing as well. But um, certainly uh, walk around, test like the waters. Um, as I said, they do have shops which are fixed priced. So um, don't try and barter with them because it's already been. Uh, at a very cheap price so what we'll do is we'll wrap this up if you've enjoyed hit the likes if you haven't enjoyed hit the thumbs down subscribe unsubscribe I'm, I'm out here to enjoy my life and be the best version of myself and we'll see you on the next exciting trip Uru.